All right. One second, YouTube. Greetings, fellow Facebookers. I do apologize. I do apologize for that minor connection issue that we had earlier. But when I tried to turn my computer screen, when I tried to turn my computer screen to um, face the kitchen so y'all could see me better, the internet cable came unplugged. All right, so Facebook, I just got the pizza in the oven. What's up, Ben? Making a uh, making the fiery fish pizza for YouTube. Got my camera phone down here filming me as we speak. Damn it. This video on for YouTube's damn near an hour long already, but that's all right. That's all right. Thanks, Liam. Glad you liked it. But yeah, I had a mild connection issue with Facebook earlier. All right. Yeah. Oh, the collar, it turned out pretty good. I mean, I had to adjust it and poke a couple holes here and there, but it turned out good. I got to where it's, uh, fits very comfortably on my neck thank you for asking but yeah youtube this is part of what i do up here on the tubes i go on facebook live while i cook but y'all saw what i put on that pizza youtube holy shit swampadelic hot sauce primo's pepper seasoning primo's peppers ground up pepper primo's peppers pizza flake like eight packets of super spicy hot sauce four of the diablo and four of the um uh fire and a little bit of tomato sauce and i mix it together with whatever swamp like hot sauce i had left and i spread it on that crust this pizza is going to be a lot bigger than any of the pieces I've ever made on YouTube before. I will say this. <clears throat> Once I unrolled it and then kind of plied it just a little bit, I was able to make a much bigger pizza. So the pizza damn near covers the whole pizza stone. I'm just saying. And then right after I put the hot sauce and the seasoned mixture, I added mozzarella cheese, pepperonis, sardines soaked in hot sauce some of that chicago style gerda maria however the fuck you pronounce it then i added more cheese one strip of bacon i took it and broke it up into pieces and put it all over the pizza and then i added curly fries doritos and then one more layer of cheese and i squished it all onto the pizza and um This is gonna be one spicy motherfucking pizza, let me tell you. Like, if you thought the pizza I was eating in the last couple of days was spicy. <laughs> That's right, YouTube. The other day a fan sent me a pizza and it had jalapenos and buffalo sauce on it for buffalo wings. And it definitely had some pretty hot kick to it. But this pizza right here, this pizza right here, hold on a second, YouTube. I, I gotta show 
show this off. Um, take that. Okay. Facebook. That's the last of my Swampadelic hot sauce, but I put it on the pizza. It's empty now. Plus, I have all four of these seasonings that I got from Primo's Peppers that the homie sent me. Um, this right here is Primo's Peppers ground up. This right here is the stuff they use to make Swampadelic hot sauce. The peppers they use for that ground up. This right here is a combination of all their peppers ground up into powder. Every pepper that Primo's Peppers uses all ground up into powder. And this right here is pepper flake for your pizza. Oh yeah. I put all four of them onto one fucking pizza. No bullshit. With the Swampadelic hot sauce. I didn't put too much tomato sauce on there though. Just enough to give it a little bit of base. I wanted the focus to be spicy. Like, burn the shit out of your mouth, spicy. And then I added, like I said, four packs of fire sauce and four packs of Diablo sauce from Taco Bell onto the pizza. So, this is going to be one spicy motherfucker. Twenty-one minutes to go. Let's see how we're looking. Ooh. Goddamn, son, that's looking good. Oh my god, twenty minutes, twenty-one minutes, twenty minutes. All right. Yes. Oh. Which is twenty minutes to go on that pizza. It's looking and smelling fantastic. I can't even smell the heat coming from the pizza, but it just looks good. It doesn't look like a spicy pizza at first glance. At first glance, it looks just like any other homemade pizza with pre-made dough. Delicious, cheesy, gooey goodness. So at first glance, you're like, oh, regular pizza. Oh, sweet pizza. You take a bite of it, you're like, whoa. But just how spicy is it going to be? I don't know. We're about to find out, though. Someone sent me a, uh, a glitter bomb in the mail, basically a spring-loaded tube with a bunch of pink glitter in it. And when I opened it on, when I opened it on camera, YouTube, it exploded all over my floor. And it's like, I got an inspection on my apartment coming up. That's when the landlord comes in and makes sure I'm keeping the place clean. And y'all send me a glitter bomb. I'm like, nice. <laughs> so I just got done, like, taking a dustpan. Like, there's certain areas where the vacuum couldn't reach. So that's when I need my broom and dustpan. And I'm just like, shoo, 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 you know what I'm saying? And all these trolls are like, oh. He didn't react normally to his glitter bomb prank. Oh, that's just because he's in a good mood from shooting. Watch. We'll, we'll get him next time. That's what you think. That's what you think. I, I've lived a very normal life, but it wasn't easy. You know, some of the things I've had to deal with growing up. You know, but um, they weren't too happy about that reaction they got from the glitter bomb. So 
more than likely they're going to sit in their little troll circle and come up with something stupid. A lot of these people have backed off, but there's like five main trolls that have been harassing me for years. I practically rule their miserable, sad lives. You know, I'm not going to want to get to me, YouTube. I mean, there are worse things I could be pissed off at. Immature juvenile pranks through the mail. Pfft, that ain't shit. <laughs> yeah. Emerald Anthurist Bricker says, Somebody call the fire department because your mouth is going to be on fire. Yeah, I don't know how spicy this piece is going to be, but YouTube saw it firsthand. And you'll fucking see it when it goes up on YouTube. But halfway through the cooking process to pretty much all I have to do is throw it in the oven and cut it. And I reconnected with Facebook Live. I'm going to check up on that piece real quick. I'll be right back. 16 minutes. To... Yeah, I heard you. I heard you loud and clear. That's looking pretty good. I'm liking that. At 16 minutes to go, that pizza's looking pretty good. I mean, I turned it on. I turned on the oven to 420 degrees right after I got done making the pizza. And I put the pizza in there and turned it up to 44 minutes just until the pizza oven, or just, just, just until the oven could warm up. And once the oven warmed up, and got nice and hot. I turned it down to 34 minutes. And we shall see. But with 16 minutes left to go, that piece is looking pretty good. I might have to bring YouTube in on the action. Get a nice, delicious, juicy close up of that pizza. Hmm. Oh, my apartment definitely is smelling pretty good. It's smelling like pizza. Mm, the smell is making my mouth water. Now, I would have added pizza Pringles if I would have had them, but I didn't. And quite honestly, I don't care. You know, I didn't. I didn't want to. I didn't want a can of pizza Pringles this time around. But that's all right. I discovered that when you unroll the dough, it makes it easier to stretch out, and you can make a bigger pizza. I mean, I added a shit ton of pepper flake, and then I added at least one capful full of all the other three of all the other three seasonings. So, this is gonna be a spicy motherfucker. That is true. I didn't make the pizza dough very thick, but thick enough to it'll hold its own, you know. Oh man, I smell pizza. That's why I've been pre periodically checking on it every so often because I don't want that pizza getting burnt. But a little bit of flakiness to the crust is all right.
Well, you kind of have to cook the crust, actually. You can't just make a pizza and eat it with raw dough. It doesn't work like that. <laughs> yeah, don't I know it. Chit-chatting with some fans on Facebook right now, YouTube, and they're like, oh, did the directions say to cook the crust? Well, I mean, you kind of have to. I mean, you can't just eat a pizza with raw dough. And someone else comments, your bathroom is going to smell that spicy ass tomorrow, bro. <laughs> No, I'm not looking. I'm I'm looking forward to trying this pizza and eating it, but I'm not looking forward to pooping it out. To be honest, I'll just go to the pizza real quick. Twelve minutes to go. Oh, oh yeah, that's looking real good. Okay, now we got 12 to 11 minutes to go, and the piece has got a little bit of cook to it. The cheese is all melted, but it can go for a little bit longer. It doesn't have to, you know what I'm saying? But that crust is starting to rise up. There's a little bit of golden flakiness to it. I might have it in there for maybe like another six to seven minutes. Because uh, that pizza is looking just about done. But um, let me unplug my phone real quick. All right. Yeah, Facebook Live while I cook. Okay, YouTube, I got to bring you in on this action, which is 10 minutes to go on this pizza. Let's take a look at it. Oh, look at that. Look at that, YouTube. Look at that close-up. Oh, my God. That is beautiful. Just beautiful. You know what? I'll let it go for the full time. We got nine minutes left. I'll let it go for the full time. I have nine minutes left on this pizza. This might have turned out... This, this pizza might turn out better than my last two that I made. Whew. Definitely gonna need mountain lightning. That tastes just as good as Mountain Dew. And it's genetic, I'm just saying. So as soon as this pizza is done and out of the oven, I'll take it out with my oven mitts 
and I'll show it off on Facebook Live before I cut it and eat it for YouTube. How's that sound? It smells like pizza in my apartment, but I can smell the heat coming off the ingredients. Holy shit. Oh, I can smell the pizza in my apartment. It smells good. But after that pizza smell, the after smell, the aftertaste of that smell, I can smell the heat from the spicy ingredients I used to make this. Holy shit. Oh, I may end up chugging a whole can of this before I eat some of that pizza, just so my stomach has some liquid in it. Oh, the crazy shit that I do for food challenges on YouTube. If you didn't know what was on it, it looks like a regular pizza with bacon, curly fries, and pepperonis on it. But you, you don't see the layers beneath the pizza, so. <laughs> mm. I love making pizza. That's so much fun. Watching your masterpiece come to life in an oven, a work of art that you can eat and fill your stomach up. Mm. On a side note, women who say, don't look at me, you creep. But here's the thing. They'll let any other guy check them out. And they're also drop dead gorgeous. Now, granted, it comes with the territory of being a good-looking female. You're going to get checked out. And sometimes it's not going to be by the guy you want to look at you. But take it as a compliment. You know, why you got to be stuck up about it? What makes every other guy more important than someone like me? You know, especially if you're going to school and you're deliberately wearing a low-cut, form-fitting shirt and, and form-fitting hip-hugger jeans, and you're deliberately dressing to show off your gorgeous female figure, and you're in high school, and you get pissed off when the wrong guy looks because he's not a jock, or he's not Mr. Popular. Ooh. You know, I've had my fair share of unattractive women checking me out, and it grosses me the fuck out beyond belief. And I'm just like, no. I'm just like, no, just no. But am I a dick about it? No. If they ask me out, I'm, I turn them down politely, of course. You know, because I've been rejected many times by women. And some of them were not nice about it. So I, I know how it feels to work up your courage and ask a woman out, you know, especially when you're given your circumstances. But... <clears throat> And you can't just tell someone, I don't want to go out with you because you're ugly as shit. That's rude. Beyond fucking rude. <coughs> so, I got some ugly ass chick asking me out. She's like, oh, why don't you want to go out with me? And I'm like, because I'm not interested in dating right now. Half the time I'll say that because I don't find the chick attractive. Or half the time I'll fucking say that because it's the fucking truth, you know? Sex and companionship is all fun and dandy, but the bullshit that goes with it, the drama, the heartache, the bullshit fights. Oh, yeah, all my friends have kids and occasionally will fight with their significant other, verbally, of course. And I'm over here like, single life, single life. I may be lonely as fuck, but I ain't got no kids. I ain't got no STDs. Single life. 
Mm. Yeah, I went and gotten I went and got myself tested for STDs the other day, and of course I came up clean. Uh, yeah. Mm. Yeah, at first when I had these attractive women in high school reject me, I was like, what the hell, you know? But then I got a taste of my own medicine. When you have somebody less attractive than yourself hating on you, it's annoying as shit. Especially when you're sitting there thinking to yourself, okay, you know, I can't I can't at least get a four and above checking me out. This is bullshit. Oh, you can't get a girl your own goddamn age to notice you? This is bullshit. I noticed that younger women definitely find me attractive. But that's always bound to happen when you're an older gentleman and that sort of thing. Like, how hard is it to find an attractive woman who's at least a four and above, doesn't have kids, that's relatively close to my age? Like, seriously. Most women, most women by now have gone out and had kids already. It's like, good God. Nope. Nope. And it's like, well, that's your own damn fault. Most people are in such a hurry to find companionship. They're afraid to be alone, so they rush out and they find it as quickly as they can. And that's usually what happens when you end up in a miserable relationship. YouTube and Facebook. If you're in a rush to find companionship, you're never going to be happy finding it. Okay, so you find somebody who's easy on the eyes. Awesome sex, man. Got yourself a trophy girlfriend. Hell yeah. But unless she's actually somewhat intelligent, then that's all it's going to be. It's purely looks. And eventually you'll get sick and tired of it. You'll want somebody with more intellect, right? Okay, so you try finding somebody who's more intellectual, but not the prettiest. All right. That can work for short term, but if there's no sexual attraction, if there's no spark, if there's no desire and lust, it's just not going to work. You might find somebody who is easy to talk to, but if there's no physical attraction. Ha, hold on a second. The oven's going off. We're definitely done. Oh, that pizza is perfect. That is perfectly cooked. Oh my God, that is beautiful. Hold on a second, I gotta get this bitch out. Oh yeah, I can smell the sardines on that pizza. Who Nelly? Smells good. Grease in cooking this. Oh man. I dump some of that grease off the pizza stone into the sink. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That grease is popping, but look at that pizza, Facebook. Oh, my God. Look at that pizza. 
Look how big that is. Much bigger than my other pizzas I've made. It's a little bit burnt on the bottom, but that's all right. That'll give it some crispiness. Look at it, YouTube. Look at it. All right. I'm going to set this down on the counter so I can cut it. Oh, 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 that looks so damn good. I'm going to let that cool off a second before I cut into it. Oh. Now, I'm not going to eat the entire pizza in one sitting. That would be that would be ridiculous, but I'll try for two slices of it. I'll let that bastard cool off for a second before I cut into it. That looked delicious, didn't it? Oh, ha, ha, man. Nice big pizza, too. Nothing small or redunculous. Well, YouTube, you saw how I made it. Now let's cut into it. Ooh, Nelly, look at that pizza. Doesn't that just look amazing? It's like a regular old curly fry covered pizza, but you can definitely see the spiciness from the Chicago style stuff just beneath the surface. Oh man, that looks so good. I don't, I don't want to eat it. I just want to frame it and hang it on the wall. That's how good that shit looks. But I did promise my YouTube peeps I'd make a crazy spicy pizza and eat it. So good old trusty pizza cut off. The key to cutting your pizza is just to cut it in slices. sitting there thinking there's no way in hell he's going to eat this pizza well not all of it in one sitting obviously but i am definitely going to try a slice of it okay. there's one down the middle I mean, that's about two slices if you split it down to half. If you cut it once more, that's like, if you cut it once more, that could be uh, a couple more slices, but I want to cut it into four pieces.
fish pizza. What do you think of that, YouTube? Does that look good? Does that look crazy enough for a King Cobra video? I think so. Get all four pieces separated. Just like that. All right. Beautiful. The pizza is cut. Ouch. Fuck, that pizza still is still pretty hot, so that's why I put it on the countertop. Nope. I'm gonna scooch this over onto there just like that. So one piece of this is equal to about two slices because I can literally, you know what I'm saying? I clearly cut this. <coughs> I clearly cut these pizzas in half if I wanted to, but that's enough for cutting. That looks good. So one piece is about two pizzas, or what? One piece is about two slices, so that can go in there. Let's get ourselves a plate and try this monstrosity. Or a bowl, whichever, I don't care. Hold on a second. Let me answer that. Hey, what up, bro? Hey, man, what's up? All right. Do you want me to come let you in or do you need to stay in the car? All right. Oh, all right. That's all right. That's all right. Um, I'll come outside real quick. Let me throw my shoes on. So hold on a second, YouTube and Facebook. Let me uh, do a couple things here. Set the camera down just like that. And grab a slice of this delicious pizza. Look at that. Big old son of a bitch. My buddy Michael Baldwin said he had something for me, so um, hold on a second. I gotta find my. Oh, uh, there they are. So I'll be right back. I'll be right back. I just uh. Tie up my shoes real quick. I'm not gonna take the camera out with me. Uh, I think y'all understand. I don't need people knowing the exact location of my apartment. And with Google satellites, it wouldn't be hard to determine that. So I just throw my shoes on real quick. And then when I get back, we'll get into trying this crazy, 
crazy pizza. But I'm not going to be too much long, so. Not going to be very long. Too much long? That's not even too much longer. Yeah, that's more appropriate, I guess. That's a more appropriate use of the English language, yes. All right, so I'll be right back. I'm gonna load some tobacco up there, up my pipe right quick. All right, I'll be right back. Catch you here in a second. Oh, before I go, turn this off. Now that I'm not cooking anymore. All right, all right, back in the saddle. I got that for after I get done eating. So what did I get? Hold on, let me. <laughs> it's a uh, shotgun shell, <laughs> shaped like a. Uh, it's shaped like one, but look at that. It's a pocket knife. How cool is that? <laughs> Hell yeah. That's a pretty sweet little pocket knife. Hell yeah. Check that out, YouTube. Got me a pocket knife in the shape of a shotgun shell. That's kind of cool. You can't deny that. All right. So we literally have... Been on this YouTube video for I don't know how long now, oh, damn near an hour, if not already an hour. Yep, we've been on this video for almost two hours now. Look at that. Look at that pizza. Oh, yeah. All right, so sorry I didn't have y'all on Facebook Live for the whole thing, but but um, well, I called down the thunder. Well, now I got it. The fiery fish pizza. And the amount of grease inside that bowl is like a little bit, just a little bit, but not too much. Oh, it smells, it smells pretty good, actually. Let's see how spicy it is, though. Mmm, 
dude, dude. <coughs> oh, that's good pizza. Ooh, that's got some heat to it. Yeah, I'm liking this pizza. I can taste the fish, the crunch from the Doritos. Oh yeah, this is beautiful. Now that right there is a slice of pizza, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that, YouTube. Look at all that delicious cheese pull. Oh, snap. <laughs> oh, yeah. There's a reason why it's called the fiery fish pizza, man. That's got some heat. It's so good. Like every flavor. Mm. Every flavor on this pizza is just like, yes. <sighs> oh, man. Oh. Hold on a second. Let's hit this delicious pizza down for a second, man. I'm gonna grab me some goddamn soda. Oh. And I still have three delicious spicy pieces, pieces left of that pizza, yeah. Is this camera still going? Yes, it is. All right. Can't have the battery dying on us. In the middle of a video. Shit. Ah. Oh. oh, man. Oh. Yeah. Don't be a baby, YouTube. This pizza is not for wimps. <sighs> Holy shit, this is spicy.
Oh man, that's good pizza, but man, that got some heat to it. Oh man, I need some milk for this. Oh. This is the kind of pizza that will separate the boys from the men. Oh, man, that one slice is a killer. Oh, cool. I haven't even finished my whole slice yet. Hold on. I'm going to finish this slice. Just you wait and see. Man. The f this is an appropriate title for the pizza, too. This is the fiery fish pizza. Ugh. That's definitely an appropriate title for this pizza. Woo, Nelly. This pizza is good, but holy fuck is it spicy. This makes the pizza that I had the other day look like nothing in comparison. Oh. Fuck, I already had a cup sitting here. Why the hell did I grab another one? Yeah. Kind of pizza you make when you have a cold. It'll clear that it'll clear your sinuses right out. <sighs> dun, 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 dun. It's the final countdown. Uh, I gotta power through these last couple of bites. Uh, I'm starting to sweat just a little bit. You know it's spicy when you feel yourself sweating. Oh. oh man. 
gotta pour myself another glass of milk. Hold on a second. Chili junkie, you'll definitely like this pizza. Ah. Oh, fuck, my eyes are watering. Whew. Oh, shit. This is the kind of crap I get myself into. Mm. It cooled down enough where I can eat it. Man, is that spicy. Uh. 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 Oh, shit. Ah. Ah. That piece is good, but holy shit, spicy. Mm. Charlene John Pizza? Mm. Oh, this is torture. No, but adding swamp would delight to your pizza. Who does this? Who the fuck? Uh. 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 I don't know if I'm sorry for my butthole when I poop this out. Uh. 
Oh, come, more bites. Come on. Come on. Oh, it burns. Oh. Ah. Fuck. Oh, I can't do it. Come on, power through it, power through it, power through it. Ah. I can't do it. Ah. I made it that fucking far. I'm so close. I can do it. Ah. Lucifer. That's got some heat to it. All my insides. One piece was enough. Oh, I did it. Oh, I fucking did it. Oh. I cleaned my plate. Ow. Ah. Why did I do this? I blew my nose. Ugh. Last time I cursed after eating that. Oh shit. Oh. I would open the window, man.
Oh, ow. I literally threw up from the heat of that. Holy fuck, that was intense. Oh, but there you go, YouTube. Oh, oh shit. Oh, my stomach hurts now. Oh, man. Oh, there you have it, YouTube. Ugh. Spicy as fuck pizza. My stomach. That pizza was mean, YouTube. But there you have it, the fiery fish pizza. And the battery is dying, so we gotta charge it. Oh, oh God. Oh, my chest. Oh, man. I can't smoke this right now. That oh, was too spicy. for a second. Thinking, man, the pizza. Oh, I'm gonna take a shit. Oh. Oh, again. Uh. <coughs> oh.
Oh god, I'm done with spicy food for a while. That was evil. It hurts. <coughs> Oh, I'm done with spicy food for a while. That was painful. Ah. Ah. Oh, my stomach hurts. The heartburn. Shit. Ah. 
I need flour and water. I need flour and water to settle my stomach. A cold breeze feels good. Uh. It's my stomach and my chest to breathe, man. That's fucking spicy. Oh, I'll check back with you in a bit, Facebook. Holy shit.